Hi, in this video, we will see how to use query parameters in API tester. Okay, so first we will see what is query parameters and then we will see how we can use these query parameters in API tester mobile app. So query parameters are a defined set of parameters attached to the end of URL. Okay, these are some of the parameters which you can attach to the end of your URL. They are extensions of the URL that are used to help define the specific content or actions based on the data being passed. To append query parameters to the end of a URL, a question mark is added followed immediately by a query parameter. Okay, so with the help of query parameters, you can retrieve specific information. Okay, so now we will see by taking one example in the API tester. So here, the query parameter which I'm going to use is the same. This is the my endpoint. Okay. So I'll go here. This is also get request. So I'll just click on this plus symbol. So this is a get request. And I'll paste my endpoint here. So this is my endpoint. And uh, let me rename this. query parameters, okay? Query parameters. So you have one of the section called query parameters, okay? So here you can provide that information. So I want to filter my products with the, what is that parameter availability? So there is no availability of products that I want to know. So available is equals to false. So you need to provide, you see, click on add param, and this is the key and value you need to provide. Key is available. You see that the moment when I use, so here it is created one uh, question mark symbol and it is appending. So available, false. Okay, you can directly give this one. Otherwise you can add in the query parameters. The moment when you add in the query parameters, so it will append in the end of your URL and before that it will put a question mark. Okay, so now if you execute this now, you see that there are two products. The in stock is false, means that is not available in the store. Those two products are not available in the store. So that's how you can retrieve the data with the help of query parameters. Okay, so you just change this one to true and then execute. Now it will pro, it will retrieve the data. There you have stock. You see there are so many products which are in stock. Okay, so this is how you can use query parameters in the API tester mobile app with the help of query parameter section. Okay. So that's all in this video. Thank you.